Hey everybody, welcome back to the brand new video and today we're going to talk about this. Now after just transferring all this data including this application from our old iPhone to our brand new iPhone 14 Pro Max, now when I just try to install this application on this device, every time I tap on any application here, it shows me this. Unable to download the application, it says cannot connect to App Store. Now if you have the same problem on your iPhone 14 Pro Max and any other iPhone that you're currently using, don't worry because here in today's video, I'll go ahead and show you an easy way to solve your problem. So let's get started. Before we start doing the process, here is a couple of things you gotta keep in mind. Your problem can happen when you have a problem with your Apple ID, internet, and sometimes happens when you have some software glitch on your phone. All right guys, and the first thing I'm gonna talk about is your internet. So all you guys can do here, just go ahead and open up your browser and just try to visit any website and see what happens. Well, if it says connection error, or for some reason, if you see it takes a long time to load, that means you have a problem with your internet connection. In that case, you can swipe down from the top here, enable airplane mode way around some time and after that just go ahead and turn it off now if you see still it doesn't help you to solve the internet problem then all you guys can do you can simply switch back your network from Wi-Fi to your cellular data or cellular data to your Wi-Fi on your iPhone 14 Pro Max well if you see still you have the same problem just like that then just go ahead and follow the next process in the next process I'm gonna talk about is your Apple ID well, sometime if you're using a multiple Apple ID, let's say you're using one Apple ID on your phone and it is different on your app store, then this problem can happen. Well, if you see still you're using the same Apple ID, but still you have the same problem here, the next thing that you want to do is just go ahead and just try to install an application on your device here. Well, after that, just go ahead and tap on settings. Well, if you get this here, then you're going to get a different Apple ID here. So just go ahead and take a look at the top here. Now into the password of the different Apple ID from here, and tap on sign in. Well, now you're gonna get a two factor authentication code here. Just go ahead and enter the two factor authentication code right here, and after that, your problem is going to be solved. Well, after that, you'll be able to see now your application has start downloading or installing on your iPhone 14 Pro Max, just like that. All right, so after that, you'll be able to install your application on your iPhone 14 Pro Max. But for some reason, if you still found out that you can't install your application and you keep getting this error, then the next things I'm gonna talk about is some of the settings on your iPhone. Just go ahead and open up your settings on your iPhone here and scroll down to your app store. Just go ahead and tap on your app store here. Make sure to just toggle on this option called app download, especially for using mobile data. Also enable this option called automatic downloads. Also choose apps downloaded. Now choose always allow. Get back here. Now just get out of here and check your problem. Well, after following all the process, simply go ahead and just restart your iPhone 14 Pro Max. Well, turn it back on and now check your problem. After doing all the process here, now if you come over here and you'll be able to see now all this application will be start downloading on your iPhone right away. So this is how you guys can solve the application on the install or unable to install any application on your iPhone 14 Pro Max or any other iPhone that you might have right now. Well, now if you still have anything to ask, please let us know in the comment section. Thanks for watching and I'll talk to you later. Peace out.